Before we get into the video guys, I am giving away 11,500 Apex coins to being with a chance of winning them. Make sure you are subbed to this channel, drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Firstly, excuse my voice, I have got man flu and it's absolutely killing me. But today guys, I bring you another Apex Legends video and today I bring you some of the latest news from the world of Apex, including an aimbotting bastard who's been caught live on Twitch, how Apex has recently been pooping all over Fortnite, achieving max level and going further and a few other bits and bobs. But before we go any further guys, if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really does help out and if you are new around here and Apex videos are what you want to see, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so before we go any further, people, I've covered numerous leaks, including two new weapons, new characters, and a few other things you may want to check out. They can be found linked within the video description via my Apex Legends video playlist. Do check them out if those things are of interest to you. Okay, so let's get into it. So it seems, people, a streamer has been caught using an aimbot within Apex Legends while playing on PC. Now, I won't mention any names, but I will link you the post if you guys do want to check it out and see those clips for yourself which seem to demonstrate him using things such as aimbots and wall hacks. Now I've watched the clips over and over and I think I'm missing something as he's missing all his shots. So whatever aimbot he is using, he needs to update those drivers. But on a serious note, at the moment I believe his Twitch is still live, but I know if Twitch find out people are using exploits within games while streaming, they will get insta banned. So I'm guessing at the moment they are still looking into the issue. So guys, check out these clips. Do you think he is using any exploits? Point me in the direction of where I am to look to tell that he is, because I'm kind of lost here. Also with Respawn already banning over 16,000 players using exploits, just stay clear of them people, they ruin games and ruin the overall experience for others. Okay, so let's move on. As we know, Apex took the world by storm, being released literally a day after rumours of a Titanfall Battle Royale was coming. It dropped with no alphas, no betas or public testing and it arrived as one of the most fluid and fun games ever. So it's no surprise the game has exploded. And in its process of exploding, it recently broke viewership records put in place by Fortnite on Twitch, which was another game which broke records and took the world by storm. The record it broke was for the most hours watched during a single day, the same day of the Twitch rival stream featuring all the big streamers including Ninja, Dr. Disrespect and Dizzy who was incredible landing a 33 kill game and I still believe till this day is a world record in itself. The Twitch rivals Apex Legends tournament was also the first Apex Legends tournament, expect many many more of these to come. During this record breaking day for Apex Legends, it had a total of 8.28 million hours watched, beating Fortnite's current record of 6.6 .6 million hours, which again is a crazy record to beat. But yeah guys, the new record holder belongs to Apex Legends. And some of the memes I've seen here are absolutely hilarious, check these out. Talking of tournaments, the second one ended last night, the Cold Red Tournament. And yet again guys, Ninja who teamed up again with NRG Dizzy and King Richard took the tournament and won 20k. Not bad at all. Can these beasts be beat? Well, at the moment it doesn't look as so. So let's move on. So now the game's been out around a week or so, people who have grinded the heck out of it have hit that max level, which at first many thought was a level 50, but in actual fact people it's a level 100. Now this level cap may change with future seasons, but at the moment you can't get any higher. So what happens when you hit a level 100? Well you continue to earn XP via a progress bar, which you will have. When that bar fills up, you still receive those legend tokens, but your level number stays the same, it doesn't go past 100. Or does it people? Well in game it certainly does not. But there is a website which you will find linked within the video description which actually tracks your true level once you go past 100. So if you get to a level 100, you level up that XP bar, although the bar resets again and you'll stay at 100, your true level then will be 101. This website tracks every single level past 100 you go to and also showcases your stats too, which is pretty cool. So that website, which is Apex Tracker, can be found linked within the video description, people. Now, at the moment, the website only works for PC, but I have been reassured Xbox and PlayStation stats will come. 
in fact by the time you watch this video people they may be live so check it out so what about apex legends on switch will it ever happen well respawn made it clear that they want to get this game on all platforms so everybody can play but when is it actually going to happen people when will Switch players get to undock that beast and play the game while taking a poop? Well, the producer of the game has said that they would love to bring Apex Legends to mobile and Switch, but there's nothing they can currently talk about. So people, unfortunately, as it remains, you have to keep that Switch docked for now. Any updates on this though, people, I will have you covered here on my channel. And guys, besides other news on new weapons and characters coming, which I've already covered, that's all the news we have at the moment. So as soon as any more news drops, I'll have you covered right here on my channel. But on that note, guys, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really does help out. If you are new around here and enjoy daily Apex Legends videos, like guides, top fives, gameplays, reviews, just about everything, make sure you subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.